Luna Classic is about to make a massive move, and if that sounds interesting to you, make sure to continue watching this video. Hey guys, Pinky Church here. Welcome back to another Luna Classic analysis video. As always, if you do enjoy my content, make sure to hit that like and subscribe button. If you guys are interested in free $600 Bitcoin, make sure to check out the link in the bio. As you guys can see on Luna Classic, we are now above this support level here at 22, which we mentioned is going to be a very, very important level. Right now, it's going to be very crucial for the bulls to actually try to take control of these highs here at the 24 mark. But there is something to keep in mind and kind of pay attention to. You guys can see on previous price analysis, when we actually broke below that level here at 29, we saw the same sort of wick to the downside a small pullback opportunity and then that continuation we are seeing the same sort of formation right now you can see we saw that break to the downside a small pullback opportunity and that liquidity grab wick that we just saw over there this is going to be very very important to play out because of course if we do see a fake out and a continuation that is a confirmation for a shorting opportunity possibly back down to the 14 support level overall now from the bullish case scenario as long as we hold above this 22 level and continue finding as support there is a short term bullish case scenario here and i'll show you guys why if you look on the hourly time frames we do have a nice formation being formed we can see that we do have this beautiful move to the downside got that liquidity and now we're consolidating at this level the next level we can possibly test would be around this 24 mark for that liquidity grab move and then see whether or not luna classic can obviously hold if we do see a move above find it as support that would give that confirmation for actually enter that long position but if that is a liquidity grab and we actually see that fake out situation and then that continuation down Side, that of course would become more of a bearish case scenario that's on the lower time frames for i right now i want to be paying attention to the four hours because on the four hours you can see that just because we are above this level we've had this situation happen before right you can see that previously we had multiple tests around this level and we look like we we're going to break out and then immediately after we dump right back down when we consolidate at these support levels and we're very close to them usually you tend to see a larger move set and right now short term and four hour does look like we possibly will be testing this overall level at 24 you can see across the other cryptocurrencies obviously we do have some massive moves happening so luna classic is lagging a little bit behind but we have to be very very careful about entering a position overall now the second case scenario that i wanted to talk about of course was that bar formation you can see that we didn't see that retest like we saw over here we actually saw three test confirmation and then the move set but we only got one test confirmation of the bar that's why i'm also leaning towards more of a fake out situation because we can possibly do something like this continue retest retest and then either see a break or a continuation higher i would much rather be comfortable entering a long position around this level here at the 18 because of the fact that it does hold quite a bit of weight on the four hour charts but that's pretty much much all i have for you guys today as always if you do enjoy my content make sure to hit that like and subscribe button if you guys are interested in free 600 bitcoin make sure to check out the link in the bio and i hope you guys have